Another question about yesterday's storms, in particular the tornado that hit Cleveland County. You say this one really flew under the radar, literally. Yeah, let's, uh, if we could take our first warned Doppler radar briefly. I want to show you something here. This is where our radar is located. First warned Doppler radar, the live one, if we could show you that. We'll zoom in on the location. There's Kings Mountain. Our radar is just on the upper right-hand corner of your screen. Now, that's, that radar takes a minute to go around, Bobby. This storm was only on the ground for two football fields wow. for about less than a minute. So it's it's conceivable that the radar actually just didn't get around quick enough and the radar down for the National Weather Service is even farther away because of its distance. The radar beam actually overshot the radar so they didn't see it at all. So this occurred in that very small time frame where both radars were unable to see it and also it was just such a small and brief tornado sure. the time wasn't really there to warn. And within a minute, you say? Yeah, it's unbelievable. I looked at the track, 110 feet wide and two football fields. That's not very long. And when it was traveling at 40 miles an hour, it was there and gone in less than a, a blink of an eye. Okay, Brad, thank you.